Ah, good morning, wakey, wakey. Mm, man, woke up feeling strong. Had a, uh, a nice, easy, light walk to the toilet. So hopefully today's uh, knee pain has turned around a little bit. But we'll see. You know, I've been dealing with this forever. So some days are good, some days are bad. We're just working on trying to make every day good. Fuck knee pain. So, yeah, if you got only knee pain in one knee, man, I'm jealous. <laughs> I got it in both, you know. I P people think that my knees are bad from a lot of running. You know, okay, this hurts, that hurts. We can just sit down and do nothing. Or we can see how far we can push the human body. So on that journey, as I started getting more and more into my mind and start realizing that while what I'm capable of doing, my mind got stronger. So the, so the pain in my knees... While it sucked, I've been doing it for so long. It was like it became my new norm. Like, okay, my knees hurt. Fuck it. Stop. You know, I, and, I, and I call it like um, stop feeling sorry for yourself. But you sometimes have to ignore your feelings. For, for me, I, I made a decision. And my decision was to be the best person I could. And I basically, a lot of mornings I wake up and say, fuck your feelings. And that doesn't mean like... You know, don't take it literally, fuck your feelings. But sometimes you have to go beyond what you're feeling. And my knees were fucked, but guess what? I wanted to run. And I knew that, okay, you can get knee replacements, this and that. Like I said, it wasn't because of I ran too much. People always want to say, oh, man, you ran so much, so you fucked up your body. You know, you don't want to be like David Goggins. I hear it all the time. You don't want to be like David Goggins. But So there's your knee. Yeah, there it is. First so that's of all, the look, look at the fact that there's zero space between those bones yes sir from the top from your 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 tibia to your femur there's zero space it's just kneecap covering two bones that are rubbing against each other mm. so whenever i fucking whenever i move that plate is very irritating so every step even like when i walk when i run it's just it's this very irritating thing just can't win one day one hurts the next day the other hurts because i'm compensating weight on one weight on the other so, uh, yeah, we're making it, we're doing it, grinding through the fucking shit every day. So let's do it. Let's grind together. Ooh, maybe we can grind today. It ain't Monday, but it's fucking Wednesday. And the way I feel mentally and physically right now without really moving more than 20 feet, um, I definitely feel like I could roll. But let's get off here, go outside, feel the weather, move around. Walk these knees and see how the day is going to go. Yeah. Well, let's do it. Oh, good morning. Wakey, wakey. <laughs> All right, you going back to bed? I'm going to go check that pot roast I made.
Oh, you're up now. Burr. All right, we got another cool, wet morning. Ooh, all right, good morning, wakey, wakey. Burr, it's chilly. Burr, let's go get some clothes on. Pull that pot roast out, yeah. Yummy, fucking yummy. Just fell apart and shredded. Mm. Oh, pot roast and bacon grease. Oh yeah. It. Look at that. Yummy fucking yummy. Slow roast beef. Bacon. Eggs. Butter. Mm. This is insane. Took the bacon. Threw the uh, pot roast and the bacon grease. And then threw the eggs and the leftovers with some butter. Mmm. So fucking good. Reminds me of when I was a kid. Alright, gotta do a wheel swap. And put them dragons on this guns. These OJs on that Winkowski. Oh yeah, sun came out looking good now. All right, we're gonna do a little disciplinary bike ride, skate sesh. All right, the sun's up, burn this fog off. So let's uh, let's cruise the skate park. Oh yeah. Ooh, that's a special treat back there. One of my favorites. Hope you can make it outside this morning. Force your shit to move. If it hurts, well, it's gonna hurt more if you don't do nothing. So do something. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Looked like this dude got hit by a car back there. Sucks. He seemed like he's all right though. Nice and quiet at the park. Got one dude here, he's cool. All right, gonna get this stretch on right by the curb. Yeah, in the sun. Man, I just started fucking sweating my ass off. Holy shit. Okay, Mr. Sun has burned that fog off and the humidity is here now, so that's gonna be a disciplinary sweat sesh. On. Ah, my guns. 9.81. This is the same kind of build that we're gonna be uh, creating Hopefully at the end of the week, I got that orange one coming. So this is one of my uh, favorite setups besides the big boy nine club. And uh, it just brings me a lot of pleasure, a lot of happiness, a lot of fun. And my feet are always on the board. Yeah, 9.81, we're at a size 10 shoe. So uh, Indy 159s, 
I've got the inverted base plates, inverted kingpin base plates. The box that you can buy without the trucks, not the lower ones. These are Ray Barbie hangers, 159s. Eighth inch risers, 56 mil dragons, put those on this morning. Bones big ball bearings, mob grip. And I believe those are heroin rails, yeah. Custom. Yeah. You. All right. Let's get on board. Let's drop in and hit a slappy. <laughs> that always feels good. Officially. Good morning. Good morning. Here's how we're rolling. Gonna drop in, hang a left, hit that curb, and see how we feel. going crazy on the curbs today just getting moving all right let's play on something else let's test the uh, balance today Okay, manual balance is on point. Only had to redo a few just to, you know, get that feeling that I'm looking for, which ain't hard to chase. Just gotta do it a couple times. Acorns everywhere. Oh, fuck you. Okay, let's go for a little ride. Man, just dripping sweat everywhere. <sighs> okay. Let's do some no slides. Yeah, we're just doing a uh, basic discipline today, you know. Consistency is what we're doing. Just hitting every obstacle quick today. All right. 
right, just a little bit on that bump. Ooh, man, I need to get in the shade. The sun's cooking. All right. Disciplinary skate sesh completed. All right, we're gonna call it quits. Just doing a disciplinary style today, cruising. All right, let's take a break. Oh man, yeah. Charge your soul. Cheers to healers. All right, getting some much needed relief so I can ride back home comfortably, cruise, but feeling good. Nice uh, ride here, disciplinary sweat sesh. Didn't fall, didn't get hurt. Didn't get any more pressure on my knees than I already got. So successful morning. Now we gotta go home and recover. Bath time. Let's do it. Had a blast. Thank you for the good times. But I gotta stay disciplined. I could have stayed and skated, uh, you know, one obstacle after another and just had fun, but it ain't about that today. That's what the weekend's for. Pound it in. Hmm. Ooh, man. Definitely feeling it. But feeling good. Feeling energized. Woo! Homeward bound. Ready to soak these knees, let me tell you. Other than that, I'm feeling pretty good. It's like, uh, I feel like I did a few Wednesdays ago, many Wednesdays ago. Oh, you sunbathing now? You gonna get in the pool and go swimming? Come on. Oh yeah, filled up for you. Oh yeah. Cheers of healers, holy shit. <laughs> Double cheers to the healers, oh man. Now I got to focus on uh, recovery all day. And when I woke up this morning, you know, I, I wasn't like supercharged with energy. Like, oh yeah, I'm going to bike and skate, blah, blah. It was, okay, I know I got to move. And walking is probably going to build the pressure fastest in my knees. Uh, make me ache today. So let's skip walking. Bike ride, put the board on. If I get to the park and I don't feel it, I don't feel it. Not, uh, not gonna add any more pain to my day. And uh, rode my bike to the park, nice and slow, felt great. Got to the park, stretched, and uh, got on, and just 9.81 gons felt amazing. Like it was glued to my feet. So I just cruised and I was like, okay, well, I know that I feel good. I could probably go and rip it, but I don't wanna do that. I just wanna. I'll, I'll, I'll hit the curbs for a second. I'll, I'll hit the manual pad for a second. I'll hit the ledge over here for a second. And just do a couple things, hit the bank and, and get out and, and go home and just focus on rest. Because I know I can overdo it really easy, really fast, get behind on this recovery for the week after yesterday's training, like listening to some of these doctors um, that are just eating... Uh, beef, bacon, butter, and eggs, is that they're 
soreness and recovery time from their workouts is damn near not there or at the at there at all they don't even have they're saying they don't really have any soreness so that would be incredible last week i started eliminating uh, more things out of the diet and uh you know this week i'm just left with beef bacon butter and eggs i'm not eating anything else just uh strictly that salt and water that's it so i don't really want to do this in a in a slow pace of well let me enjoy this until you know i i'm, I'm hurting more let me keep enjoying this and it's like because the yogurt i was treating it as a, as a dessert you know putting blueberries and uh protein powder and and uh, mixing it up but it's like okay well that's that's three other things in my body that could be contributing to inflammation so let's just eliminate those so yeah, I've eliminated everything except for <laughs> beef, pig, and butter and eggs. Yeah. Just, uh, you know, and I've been seeing more people doing, uh, you know, self-experimental stuff and having a YouTube channel documenting their, uh, their journey. And that's, uh, that's pretty motivating to see. I didn't know really other people were doing it. I mean, I didn't really think about it. Of course, people are probably doing everything. But, um, you know, shit just doesn't pop up in the algorithms. And it, now it started popping up, I guess, since it's thinking that's what I'm doing. Um, but I'm not doing anything that anybody's doing. I'm doing me. And what I'm doing is trying to feel as fucking good as I can. And uh, listening to people with experience and knowledge uh, for a little extra guidance. I'm, I'm listening to people that are actually showing documentation of provable fucking research um so that's uh my my daily education um and i thrive off of that you know i thrive off learning and trying new things to better myself and if i can better myself then i can help somebody else better themselves but if i can't well, I'm already doing it, so, I mean, I'm benefiting from years ago, you know? If you go back and see my YouTube videos from years ago, when uh, I had a drink in my hand every every time you saw me, uh, it's definitely a different day now, and, um, and I feel way better than I felt back then, let me tell you. I, I can remember exactly how I felt if I see any of the old videos. Oh, I know exactly how I felt. I know why I was drinking that. I know exactly what was going on that day, and it's like, Man, I'm so glad I don't have to have any of that in my thought process anymore. Like, even with the food, you know, the uh, the diet elimination, I just don't have to have any of that in my psyche. And it's, uh, it's awesome because I have more time to put things that I do want to know in my, in my mind and in my body. So, um, yeah, it's been, uh, it's been awesome. Fourth year of, uh, of alcohol sobriety has been the best year yet and i can only see it getting better and better every year and uh, i was just talking to somebody this morning at the skate park and um he's uh 33 and i was like oh man I, I i was just telling my friend kyle when i was 33 that was like the most optimal i had felt at that time after being ran over by a fucking van at 45 mile an hour and um i was like the, the best that i feel today is because i quit drinking you know i've, I've been sober four years and he goes, yeah, I, I still got the vice, you know, I still drink every day, but you know, not like I used to, you know, like when I was in my twenties, I got, I got kids now. So I'm gonna, I try to be more responsible, but, uh, he's like, yeah, I, I know I got to give it up sometime, but you know, we all got our pain. And, and I was like, oh, I know I, I, I use that for pain medication for 20 fucking years, you know? And, uh, it just, it, it, it temporary was relief that's all it was causing more damage for the future and um wish i would have known that then but that's how you get to know that shit so don't take it for what i say you got you gotta just uh, do it yourself i'm gonna put this out go run a hot bath soak get more education and uh just put my feet up let my knees rest I got uh, the pressure 
it's uh, not not that bad today, but I got it, you know. And it's like, if I keep going and going, uh, my day is going to get shortened. So if I take a break now, uh, I'll get more out of the day later. I'll be able to take on to the dog park and let her get some. So that's how I got to manage the day. So yeah, we're doing it. Uh, hopefully, my morning charge helped your morning charge. And um, if you got it, I'm glad you got it. If you're gonna get it, I'm glad you're gonna get it. If you're not gonna do it, well then fuck, you're wasting your time watching this shit because I'm trying to motivate you to go fucking do it. Just go outside, you know, it, it, the least possible. Walk out the back door, uh, get some privacy and just fucking open yourself up to the sun and let the sun feed you. Minimum, five minutes. If it burns, fucking take it, you need it. You know, don't, don't, uh, don't be scared. Just uh, absorb that energy, stretch, feel your bones crack and your joints fucking flex. And um, yeah, do it every day, you know, at the minimum. Do that every day at the minimum. All right, we'll see you. I leave my own parade Cause this new shit I drop right now Gonna make your fucking day oh, I got shit to lose just like a plumber Locked down like yay for three summers Locked down like DMX when he peel out Vroom vroom you know I'm the only real out First trying to warm up with no diploma I used to drive to Kelowna get booed like a fucking loner Cause I was scared of myself and I showed it to everybody This go out to anybody who yelling we ready sonny like Ready, ready, ready What's up, what's up, what's up? First try no woman. First try no woman. First try no woman. Yeah, I might just go ahead and say. First try no woman. First try no.